So I'm here with my friend John, and we're talking about the bridge between concrete and virtual. Yeah. yeah. Well, what I what I love about this sandbox is that the kids are playing absolutely in the real world with real objects in a real way. But there's also, but the game is extended and enriched by the fact that there's a virtual application to it as well. So it's not it's not simulating reality. It is reality, but there's another whole dimension that's added to it, and I think that's. The, the potential for this over the next five years, this kind of thing, just seems to me incredibly exciting. Because there's nothing manufactured about it. It's a sand pit. We all know what a sand pit is. But now it's a, you know, it's a 21st century sand pit. I just love it. It's 21st great. century sand pit. Yeah. yeah and, but, but the big question is, what does this mean? This generation of kids are going to have uh, a completely different understanding of the way the technologies which we develop, which are screen-based and are therefore not in the real world, how they relate to the real world. And the potential for that seems to me incredibly exciting. And so, you know, old Russo's line about um, you know, somebody, somebody's learning a, a skills as an artisan in a workshop and they think they're becoming an artisan, but they're becoming a philosopher because they're doing things with their hands. And this thing of doing things with your hands, and that is absolutely integrated with what you're doing with your head, and what you're doing with your heart. That's what seems to me potentially incredibly exciting about all this stuff. John, thank you. I, now I'm really afraid that my iPad won't have captured those beautiful <laughs> words. That was great. Thank, well, thanks for that.